Hello, future internet people. It is me, Richard, from KP's Adventures, here with the Crispy Ghost, playing some more trucks. And he is going to magically appear in one of these four trucks in front of us. I'm already in one. See if you can guess which one. Uh, not the purple one. Not my good one. Uh, you're in the little one on the right. I was until I started jumping around. Ah! Ha -ha! Now I'm in the good one. <laughs> Eat shit. Oh. All right. Uh, <laughs> what do we want to do? There's a threatening accident. Into this one. A threatening accident. Yeah. What is threatening accident? I don't know. It's just a task giver. I have no details. Are you threatening me? Alternatively, we can go to the final. Um, watchtower and get that open. Um, whatever you want to do. The watchtower is in a whole bunch of water, which historically we are fantastic at getting through. Is it the one over near the drilling site? Yeah. That drilling site that we just had to take some consumables from the farm through to in such a short distance. Oh, was that the one where I was riding you at the end and then we both died? Uh, no, that was... That was the drilling a bit. Drill different bit. hill somewhere, I'm pretty sure. Unless it was in there and I'm just forgetting it. I don't know. Let's go to the watchtower. Okay, should I be in a car that has four-wheel drive? It will indeed be helpful if you have four-wheel drive, yes. I'm gonna go in the truck that has low gear plus. <gasps> oh my god. Uh that button and then this button and then this here we go I've used five liters of petrol doing absolutely nothing excellent just the way we like it maybe there's a petrol station on the way there is not I'm pretty sure but that's okay uh, I'm also assuming unlike me you have not set any waypoint markers and you're just gonna be following me I put a waypoint marker, but I'm going to be following <laughs> you anyway. I mean, you just put down the final destination, I assume, and just hope for the best. Yeah, I didn't bother, like, putting many waypoints in between. <laughs> because who needs to know where they're going, right? You just get in your truck and you go. Look, I, I, ne I only need to know where I'm going. I don't need to know how to get there. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Why did you suddenly pull to the left truck? Now, why are you not pulling to the left? <laughs> oh my god. That's a very me thing you just did, Richard. <laughs> <sighs> and that was not at all intentional. Aha! Well done. This is why... I have my go anywhere truck. I would never have recovered from that. The other thing we could do. Chris, oh, I'm not in four wheel drive mode. That's why I'm having so much trouble. Well, I was just about to say the other thing we could do, and it's a little potentially dangerous. You could actually set some waypoints and then we could race. I'm not sure that that would work out very well. I don't know. You're in a smaller, lighter car but I'm in a go-anywhere truck. Yeah, and um, I would definitely flip and roll over somewhere. <laughs> and then not have you to rescue me. And you're saying that I won't have that? I mean, I could send you a very quick screenshot of my one here, and you can set the same waypoint markers, and then we're both on the same track. Well, I've now m moved my waypoint markers, so I've got many waypoints. If you do want to, uh, race. I'm happy to race. Alright. Alright. Uh, did you, you can do the countdown, Chris. I believe in you. Three, two, one, go. Going! Nice. I'm going to go through this water because that's going to work so well for me. You're going the farm route. 
or the farm route if you're American. <clears throat> what if you're um, Italian? I don't know Italian, <laughs> so farm, eh? Because Italians are like Canadian, right? Yeah, I hear they're the Canadians of Europe. Yeah. Everybody loves Canadians from Europe. Oh no. Eh, mild obstacle. Logan Plus, baby! <laughs> it's okay, Chris. I got over the mild obstacle. And I got through that watery bit. You'll be pleased to know I'm going bit. at a not at all breakneck speed. I'm going at a blistering, I'm going to roll on something I can't see soon. <laughs> move your camera around. Uh, you think I'm not? You think I won't roll anyway? <laughs> I think that's exactly the situation, yes. I admire your optimism, Richard, but fuck you. <laughs> mm, you're not really my type, and I am a taken woman. Look, people cheat on their spouses all the time. I hear it's what all the cool hair are doing. <laughs> well, as a proud gay man, I can say no to that. Is there such a thing as a not proud gay man? It's all that gay pride, Richard. Uh, there is such a thing. It's called being in the closet, Christopher. You can be pride, pride in the closet. <laughs> you can be a whole pride in the closet. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, but you really shouldn't keep lions in the closet. There's they, a lot of lions in they there. They get a little uh, worked up. So many lions. <laughs> Don't run when you play lions, Richard. Just so long as you colour with inside the lines, you're good. <laughs> I see what you did there. I made a funny with my mouth noises. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, ow. I've made it to some sort of tree bog. I've made it to a bridge. Whoa, <clears throat> whoa. I mean, I have also made it to our watchtower, but it's not the final watchtower. It's not the correct watchtower. <clears throat> oh, well, this tree bug's slow going. <laughs> I probably should have gone around the tree bug. What tree bug? But it's are you too late for that now. Where are you? Oh, I see. You're actually making very decent progress. <laughs> I'm in tree bug. I'm stuck in tree bug. I'm stuck on a fucking log in the bug. Log bug. Bug log. I really should not have stopped to check where you are because <coughs> I feel like you're actually almost there. <laughs> but meanwhile, I'm just not. Oh. Logie! I'm lock. stuck! I have to winch! Me too! I'm winching! Me too! Yay! Okay, I've escaped tree bug. Oh my god. Can you let go of that? <clears throat> grab onto that. Go! Come on, Logia Plus. You can do it, baby. I can't wait till I get Logia Plus for this truck. If it in fact even gets Logia Plus. I'd love Logia Plus for any of my trucks. None of my trucks have Logia Plus. And my truck that's the same truck as your good truck, I am trying to grind up some money to get it lifted because it is low to the ground and heavy <laughs> oh here's the part where i rolled oh, sideways oh. down the hill Whew. i almost lost it and went into the i want to say lake sideways uh well there was a certain amount of sideways movement It's okay, Chris, because I am <laughs> getting there. Have you made it to the destination yet? I feel like you were almost there last time. No, I I'm... According to my next waypoint, I'm 300 meters away from wherever my next waypoint Ow. is. Well, I just hurt my engine a smidge more. Why did you do that? For funsies, Chris. Oh, God, I almost rolled. Oh, and now I'm almost rolling in the other direction. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Aren't you glad we raced? <laughs> so, oh, no, no, oh god, oh god, what is this road? I have no idea.
lady. Where the fuck am I? Where the fuck does the road go? Use oh my map. god! Use your map, Hang Christopher. On. Where does this road go? Are you using your control again, or have you changed the keyboard? I'm using the controller, but I, I just... I, I figured out how to move waypoints with the controller. I just... Oh, I broke the engine. Oh god, I'm stuck in a hole. I, I, re I really don't want to help my competitor, but just remember you do have a repair kit on that truck. I'm, I'm not following the road. I'm going off-road. I'm going off-road. And hoping uh, this works out well for me. Okay, I'm oh, back on a road. It's now just a straight line to the thing. I'm 170 meters away. Um... I'm going off-road again. I have no idea how well this will work out for me. But we will see. Okay, I have made it to the boggy water. I'm wading in. I'm getting stuck. This is too bad. I'm in bull rushes. Where are you? I don't see you anywhere. <laughs> uh, well, if it helps, oh, I'm slowly <laughs> submerging myself. Ah, <laughs> oh, me too. <laughs> but I'm slowly submerging myself slightly closer to it. <laughs> oh, I see. There you are. Hey, buddy. <laughs> uh, this. Can this point? No. Okay. This to there. Dangerous water level. We have a snorkel. Although it doesn't help if you're almost below the snorkel, I suppose. That is a valid point game. I'll hand you that one. I'm 70 meters away. 28 meters away. Oh no, Chris! Slow down! <laughs> I feel like there was a better way to do this. Oh man, there was actual land on the other side of it. <laughs> Have you made it to the other side? No, I looked at the map because I am making like no progress at this point. I'm, I'm achieving dangerous water level. And I have nothing I can winch to and I'm, ch I'm just fucking swimming in petrol that I'm wasting. Out of Loki, but uh, Olgi, all wheel drive. That's the words. I am 35 meters away, 30 meters away. Where have you gone? I think I'm to your right. Oh, there you are. Hey, buddy. I'm stuck. <laughs> achieve hopeful victory. Okay, stop there, and now, oh, uh, grab from the back, to the front, and pull, you mighty stallion, pull! Hey, Chris. Well, there was a winch point right there that I could have connected to at any I time. I just won. Oh, I'm drowning the truck. Well, I'm... I have just won, Chris. Because you achieved land before I did. Hang on. Hang on. I've almost used all of your petrol, Richard. <laughs> Would you like some assistance? I got this. <laughs> no available winch points. Oh, there we go. I attached myself to you. <laughs> ah. Made it. Nailed it. Okay, now I need to get unstuck. But I feel as though the only things around me are really, really tiny trees. <laughs> oh, wait, no! I can winch to that. Okay, cool. Oh, well, of course. I picked the bush next to the observation tower. And... I've made it onto land. There you go, you can winch to me if you need. 
I winched my side to the tower, and then I <laughs> ran into you. Uh, I've got 12 liters of petrol left. I can't go anywhere. <laughs> Um, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can fix this. I can fix this, Chris. Refuel you. Oh, thank How's you. that? Is that better? That is much better. Alright. Uh, where would you like to go? What would you like to do? I don't know. I have to say, I really enjoyed your come from behind victory like that. <laughs> <laughs> I was fully expecting to lose at the end there. And I thought I would win, and then I got stuck in the water, and then when I looked at the map, I went, oh man, if I'd just gone around all that water, I could have made it. Or even if I'd just gone to the left where the land was that you went across. <laughs> Let's go to Solid Foundation. A solid Foundation. And oh, do is. that. I have no idea what it is, because it's another one of those things that gives me no information. But, I feel like whatever it is, is doable on less than 100 litres for me. Is there a petrol station somewhere? I don't know. I did not look. Oh, ow. Uh, ow. Eh. Rock. There we go. Okay. I got over the tiny boulder. Eh. Eh. Okay. Auto! I need reverse. Eh. No! <laughs> what? There's a person back here. Well, you shouldn't tailgate, Chris. There's whole laws about that. Ow! We're in God's country now, Richard. Human laws do not apply. Well, I don't believe in the in the judge, so my rules apply. Hiya! Wow, this is actually helping to speed me up. Yeah. Keep pushing me, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. <laughs> ah. Yeah. No, we we actually now need to go left. <laughs> I'll push you from this side. We are total professionals. I mean, look at us. We are good at the teamworks. We're getting shit done. Uh, we made it to that watchtower with absolutely no one flipping. Which I feel is an absolute must when it comes to anything truck related. I almost did twice. Yes, but you didn't, which is the important part. No, Chris. How are you being so much faster than me? It's almost like you have a very fast truck that has more capability than mine. I mean, your zippy little thing that'll roll as soon as you look at it. <laughs> I mean, it is very floaty. I have grown accustomed to its floatiness, though. But having said that, it was also made by me for me. Made by Richards for Richards. Oh, Alpha Light! Oh, Have yeah. I helped? Horn! Oh, Chris! <laughs> I'm trying! <laughs> Wait, I know. L plus! Yeah! Oh, wow, that actually helped out quite a lot. Yeah. To the point where I caught up and ramped you. <laughs> Bad news though, Chris. Down to 78 litres. What oh. am I stuck on? And it's getting a lot swampier. Wait, oh! What? Why am I actually stuck? Are you in low plus? Because then you cannot reverse. I wasn't trying to reverse. I was just trying to go. On my screen, you were pushed up against a tree. And I thought it was very obvious. I looked like I was not stuck on the tree anymore on mine. Low plus. I fucking love low plus. How does one achieve low plus, Richard? What is this gearbox that has low plus? I just found it out in the world. 
as I was doing truck business. And then I purchased it for my truck. Oh, I was stuck on a fucking dead tree. That's why I wasn't moving. Richard winched to me. <laughs> ah, yes, the good old side winch. There we go. <laughs> the most stable of all the winches. It works so well. It's our signature move. We need to go left, Chris. Left. I'm trying to left. Left. No, this <laughs> you're, left. You're pulling me right. <laughs> left. No, you're actually going past where we need to go. I know because I'm trying to turn left and it keeps just dragging me to the right. This Here way, we go. Chris. Here we Show go. task. Uh, life of a recluse seems to be catching on. A guy wants to build a house in the middle of nowhere and it's getting a shipment of concrete slabs he wants to use for foundation. Can you haul them? Sure. Start tracking. Where are we getting these things from? I don't know. Uh, from the drilling what, site? What, uh... From the drilling site, Chris, is the closest one. But... I don't think we have the petrol for that. I was just looking to see where the closest petrol station is. Uh, there's one down by the gateway back to Black River. And that's the only one! <laughs> yeah... I'm starting to get a sense that this is a very petrol-hungry level. Hmm... Hmm... I might, because I can, teleport myself back home! Well, ah, da. So much petrol. I can't do that. <laughs> yes, but if you get out of that truck, I can then teleport it back home as well. Uh... What was the button to turn the engine off? I've completely forgotten. There we go. Uh, B. Back. Back. B. Okay. Uh, now, which one of these many icons? There we go. U. To recover. Leave garage. Go. Alright. Uh, oh, wrong button. That button. Change truck. To my fleet star. Alright. Did you really have to park that one right up against <laughs> the front of my car? And by car, I mean truck. Your truck was giving that truck a kiss. Your Wait, winch stop, is Chris. an attack. Stop! Ah, there we go. Okay, now we can go. Oh, I see. Okay, where am we, Argo? Uh, pretty much back to where we were. I no longer have a, uh, thing showing me where well. it is. So, uh, <laughs> I'll save you! With Thanks, the power buddy. of winching to your side. Ah, oh, so helpful. <laughs> left, Chris, left! I'm trying, it makes it really hard to turn left when you're Ow. attached to my right. No! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> no, I'm out of control! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> go, Chris, go! I'm trying! <laughs> Just pull me. <laughs> pull oh, no. me, truck daddy. <laughs> You're going the wrong way, Chris. <laughs> Come with me, Chris. Uh, I think I might have to... Oh, wait, no. No, I'm getting you there. Ah, there we go. Okay. Left. <laughs> Look, I think I'm gonna need a longer lead if you're gonna do this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, fine. Uh, this button. Uh, no, no you, you've gone too far. Come back. I can't, can't reach you. Can't reach you. Can't reach you. Okay, okay, stop. Perfect. 
now you have all the lead I can give you. I can't see how this could possibly go wrong. I can't either. It's a until I have to turn left. Well, it's a flawless system, right? I mean, there's so is much slack currently. It is left, yes. Ow! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> you broke my winch. Come back here. We shall not go unwinched, Chris. Oh. Oh, I want you to grab onto that one. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so now we know a worst case scenario. <laughs> Uh, did you want to go through the farm, or did you want to go around the farm? I'm happy to go around the farm. Cool. This way. Uh. I'm helping! Yay! Uh... <laughs> I can't fix this. <laughs> I don't know if I can fix this. Alright, oh, wait, hang on. If I reverse, maybe I can fix this. <laughs> Go. Oh, I'm getting there. <laughs> slowly, slowly. Yeah. Definitely how the game was meant to be played. Aw, <laughs> uh, yeah. As I blind you with my high beams. Oh, yeah, I forgot to turn my lights on. And we'll be turning right onto this little path right here. This one, this one. Hey, you know, some... that's what you get for <laughs> letting go of your buddy. I didn't let go of my buddy. The winch disconnected when I rolled. <laughs> well, I'm back. I'm attached. Is it this little path? Yeah. The little path that looks like it's absolutely not meant to be for trucks, but it, it is, yes. I can't actually tell where this little path goes. Is it? Does it go oh, this way? Oh, wait, no, we're, we're not on the path yet. Mm -hmm. um, just keep going in a forward line. Camera. Camera. There we go. Okay. Now I can see what I'm doing. Where is this little path? That's a tree. <sighs> eh, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Oh, so the little path that you told me to head towards was several meters further up the road. <laughs> Shh. We don't point out our failings, Chris. That's not how you build friendship. You're supposed to support each other and well, build up confidence with your friend. Ugh, Chris, you're pulling me into a tree. <laughs> you're big. Just push him down. <laughs> yeah, I can't do it for that size tree. I, I hate to admit this, Chris, but I may need my independence for a second. No. Wait, wait. If you let go, I don't know what I'll do. Uh, okay, well, pull me, Chris. Pull! Together we can pull this tree down. I don't actually know if that's true Hello, or not. plus engaged! I don't know if this tree is making any difference whatsoever. Uh, I don't I'm... think it's working. Yeah, I'm gonna say no. Okay. I have released you temporarily. Sweet, terrible freedom! Woo! Oh no, he's he's starting to realize that he doesn't actually need me. Oh no! And I've needed him all along. I found the small path. It's almost like I was holding him back this whole time. God, now I'm stuck on another tree. It's almost like this this part wasn't designed for a truck of this size to go through. That would be weird. First personing it because I couldn't actually see the tree that I was hitting. <laughs> eh. And now I I can't tell what's actually happening now. Okay, let's go to the to the right. Okay. We're just breaking a tree entirely. Ah! I'm just watching this on the map and just watching you go forward, back, forward, back, forward, back, forward, back. Hey, I'm getting there. Okay. Oh. Okay. 
Okay. Am I heading towards you now? I'm to your right. Oh, I see. There we go. Uh, now, do we need to be going right? Cool. Uh, oh, but before that... Before that... Ah! You're attached to the wrong side. Well, I have to even you out, Chris. As a massage therapist, it would be remiss of me to get you all wonky. So I'm going to pull you the other way. And that just levels everything. Go, Chris, go! Woo! fuel tank. I don't know if it's been punctured or if it's just dented. <coughs> oh, how are we going to I choose to believe dented. Together? At least you don't have to go across the bridges slightly sideways. Whoa, and yet, there I go. <laughs> help, Chris, help! I might be able to help myself. Oh, oh. okay. Uh, well, this isn't working. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Hey! Look at you going! Oh, Richard, help! <laughs> <laughs> uh, this button. Man, they have so many buttons in this game. <laughs> Please don't go backwards and flip again. Some momentum this way and pull. Ah, oh, so close. Wait, wait. Yes. Hey. Yes! <laughs> I mean, that was my plan all along. Yeah, to use the momentum of the hill to get the extra force that's required. No. No. Yes. Yes. Because F equals M A and nine point eight meters per second squared. And other such math words. Have I? Did I do it? Did I convince you that I was smart the whole time? You sure did. But I couldn't help but notice that I am untethered. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Okay. To ensure I tether you properly, I have to bring up my functions menu, and then I can't actually do anything until I get out of my functions menu. So there's that brief moment where you start pulling away, and I'm like, quick, quick, before he hurts himself! <laughs> Logie! Diffluck! Horn! Horn and lights! Horn and lights! Oh no, I pressed unconnect. Quick, Richard, connect me again. Like mama bird to baby bird. There we go. Go, Chris. Go, you beautiful stallion. Hear me I roar. believe in you. <laughs> I like the sound of your horn way better than mine. Yeah, yours sounds a little wimpy for such a big truck. It also Can you change the horns in this game? Don't know. But it also kinda reminds me of a train horn. Yes. Okay. There we go. Does it help if I push you, Chris? Sometimes. Like that? Well, that time I feared for my life. <laughs> so. Yeah, super helpful the whole time. Ow! My engine! Ow, my side! <laughs> oh, you've got two sides, it's fine. I've only got one engine. You got your little tugboat. <laughs> yeah, but I feel like that won't be an option when my engine completely dies. Uh, and I'm not in the truck that gives piggybacks. No. That would be our little truck. <laughs> the little truck that unfortunately can't carry concrete slabs. Because and it don't got no back on it? 
Yeah. And I don't have enough money to get it back on it. I've only got like $450. Do you not have a, um... A trailer? Uh, that's actually a very good point. And yes, I probably do. Uh, we need to get into the drilling site, so we could either go forward and left or just straight across in the bush bit. Well, you're between me and the bush bit, so I can really only go forward anyway. <laughs> and well, since you're going forward, I have to join you, so... It's, it's, it's the law. It's the law. La la. La la. La lo la lo. La lo la lo la lo. Ah, oh, that's what that song was. That's that Shakira song. La lo la la la. <laughs> yes, yes it is. I love when you just suddenly realize something. <laughs> well, no, my brain was like recogni recognition. What is? <laughs> PROCESSING! <laughs> if you heard that grinding sound, it wasn't the car. <laughs> <laughs> I was just looking at the baby dog who's being very needy, even though she's got an hour and a half till dinner. Low gear, diff lock, horn, deploy! Regular gear, all wheel drive, horn. Lights, toggle! I'm being dragged sideways, I can't turn left! <laughs> okay. Every effort to turn left is met with more right! <laughs> Hang on. Haha, -ha, I saw you coming! <laughs> I wasn't trying to hit you. <laughs> and yet you almost did. I couldn't figure out which way left, I was going. Chris, left! I'm trying! You're, you're attached to right! <laughs> ah! Ow! Ow! My engine! <laughs> <laughs> oh my side! Oh no, it says no visible points. Ah, there we go. Ah, good old safety. We're going this way, Chris. <laughs> no, we're actually going this I way. I didn't steer. I was trying to go that way until you attached me and then forced me to go that way. <laughs> I did not steer myself into that puddle. <laughs> uh -huh. I just didn't fight the inevitability of what was going <laughs> to happen to me. To the yellow square. Okay, cargo management, here we go. Uh, oh, I've got six litres of fuel left. Five litres. What? What? How do I... How do I... I have oh, two and a half it's... minutes worth of fuel left. <laughs> Well, here, I'll un unlatch you. Oh, and then apparently relatch to you while I try and get to the concrete slab that's just to the left, because apparently it's not in <coughs> the management of the cargo, it's just sitting there. Do we need to have had a um, crane? I hope not. Because that's looking like we needed to have a crane. Richard, did you not read? <laughs> In the description of the job, it says deliver to Norton's house, concrete slab times one. And then in red, immediately underneath that, truck with crane is recommended. <laughs> Obviously, I did not read that. Chris, thank you very much. <laughs> so to be able to get a crane, I have to magically recover. <laughs> I'm going to use the two remaining litres of uh, petrol driving in half a circle. How do we customise? Here it is. And it was in the frame add-ons. Yes. Uh, loading crane. Yes. Install. <clears throat> okay, Richard, your uh, truck is at the place out of petrol. Well, come grab a different truck. And then I, have. I shall I shall be magic. I shall do the magic. But also, Chris, we now have to go to a different place to get the concrete. Why? 
because I may have pressed a few buttons and made the concrete disappear. Why don't you just reset the job? Because I don't know how to do that, Chris! It's in the map screen. You, you go to the job and then you press, um... Well, I can't do it because it's not my wow. game, but there should be a... Restart or reset. Can I just... Can I look at it here? <laughs> ah! Game. Norton's house. No. 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 Why are you doing this to me, game? Okay, fine. Keyboard. Deploy. Norton's house. How... There is no way to do that, Chris. There should be. <laughs> if there is, I don't know how. When you're when you're in the um the, the tasks menu bit and you you go to solid foundation, where it's like start and stop tracking, is there no reset job? I don't even <laughs> have the start and stop tracking. Oh. Unless yeah, I, that's weird. Unless I need to do it in a different menu. Oh, here we go. Uh, no, I only have start and stop tracking. Ah, interesting. Mm, quite so, yes, mm, indeed. But <laughs> we can get a cop. <coughs> excuse me, a concrete slab on the other side of the dam. Damn. Damn, girl! Well, okay. <coughs> so... <coughs> uh, oh, hold on. Let me get out of this... Unless you wanted to crane this time. I don't mind. Would you like me to winch to you? <laughs> I too am in your truck. Then let us leave. I assume you totally know where we're going. I will as long as I follow you. So what I'm hearing is it's a perfect time for a game of hide and seek. You think you're faster than me? God, no. Do I think I might be able to get places you can't? Maybe. I'm significantly heavier now that I have a crane. Although, having said that, you haven't caught up to me yet, so maybe I am faster. And I did win the race. Only because I got stuck in the water. Yeah. And didn't realize there was a hidden tree I could latch to. That's why you bring up your menu instead of just pressing the, the winch button. <clears throat> but the winch button is so convenient. Yes, but the other one gives you so much information. Gives you all winch me, Daddy! Uh, <laughs> on my Jesus screen, your winch isn't actually attached to anything. It's just sort of hovering behind my truck. Oh, that's what happened to me that last time, like, before we left last time. Uh, you were actually surprisingly close. Did you want me to slow down so you can winch to, like, my side or something? Ow, it's okay, I'm winched to your side! <laughs> okay. Oh, my engine! <laughs> it's okay, oh, it's Chris. <laughs> I took no damage whatsoever. <laughs> I've winched us together. <laughs> oh. Well, this is doing virtually oh, wow. nothing to my performance, so... Well, that's fine. This oh, is ow. <laughs> Okay, I take it back. It's done a few things to my turn. That was really good for my fuel efficiency. <laughs> well, do it again. Hang on. Wait. Hang on. You winch to on. me. I want to winch to your side, though. Okay. How's nope. that? Nope. Nope. 
<laughs> yes. Ow. You bitch. Ah! <laughs> Richard, no. Okay, I'll help in the best way possible. The power of ramming. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> ah! What? I'm, I'm holding forward. Why are you going back? All right. No choice but to go all the way over. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Chris! Chris! <laughs> we got fixed this! We've... We've, uh... <laughs> we've, we've not... We've not done well. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> um... I don't... Can I use my crane? Activate anchors! Uh, Perfect! <laughs> I I can Can you I can use not, the crane? No, I cannot do anything. I think uh. I, I think a recover might be in order. <laughs> <laughs> How do we always end up in these situations every time, Chris? <laughs> uh look. Your skill. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh this one. This one. Oh, wrong button. To this one. All right. Uh. Let's. Do you can have the big truck this time, <laughs> and I'll show you how to winch <clears throat> to it properly. All right, fine. Ha ha, uh, fool! I say as I winch <laughs> to the wrong truck. <laughs> so long, loser. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> you're winched to the air behind me. That's okay. Like you said, this is doing <clears throat> wonders for my fuel efficiency. Yeah, so when I was winched to your side, I didn't have to steer or anything, and it was just you pulling me, and I was using 1.1 liters a minute. It was great. Ah, oh, <clears throat> I can't do uh -huh. it in neutral? Boobs. What happens if you winch me in low gear? When I'm in low gear? Yeah. Uh, stop and we'll <clears> find <throat> out. Okay. Yeah. The handbrake is not helping. I'm still rolling. Why am I not <clears throat> able to winch to your side? I can only winch to your back. Okay. Uh, now. Low, low minus. I mean the lowest gear possible. Oh, this is terrible for- this is just tug of war at this point. <laughs> this is well, terrible for my fuel efficiency. It's doing wonders for mine, I'm at 1.2 litres per <clears throat> minute. Okay, regular low. How's that? Well, I no longer feel like I'm pulling against the wind. Low plus? <clears throat> Are we doing better? Ow, what the fuck was that? A rock. Hi, gear. I missed the road. <laughs> 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 Wait, no! How is no! My engine? Yes. No. The engine is stolen. No. Huh. So I found a way that I can just stall this car. <clears throat> How? Just try and take off in high gear. Alright, do you need help, Chris? Um, yes, I'm stuck. Okay. Oh, all-wheel drive. <clears throat> Low plus. Diff lock. Helping. Helping. Turn off diff lock, because I was about to break my car. Ah, there we go, okay. <clears throat> okay, out of low plus. Let's go, Chris. Let's go. Whoa. Let's go indeed. Yeah. <clears throat> can't see anything because your car is too giant, Chris. I can't like, see anything because my car is too giant also. Hey, that was helpful. We would like Fuel buttons. efficiency plus. There we go. Oh, 
Whoa. Whoa. Richard. Whoa. No, Richard. Yes, do the ballet. Yes. All right, I am trusting you entirely <laughs> to deliver me to where we need to go. <laughs> I can totally help with steering. Yep, that's that's me being helpful. Am I doing I it though? I feel like we're in one of those action movies. <laughs> We just need a, uh, a few explosions, <coughs> which I feel like is within our uh, <laughs> repertoire. <laughs> Indeed. Oh no, there's a corner coming up, Chris. The corner that undid us last time. It's okay. Whoa. You made it. <laughs> you very nearly didn't make it <coughs> for me. <laughs> Look, that's still better than what we did last time. Neither of us made it last How time. <laughs> working better than it was when we were driving just normally. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> this makes no sense. Hey, hey, hey! There's a wall sorry, there! Sorry. I was looking, I was too busy rotating the camera around us, observing, than paying attention to where the fuck I was going. <laughs> I could tell! <clears throat> Alright, we, we need going? to go in here. sure it's in here. Hold on, let me check my map. Uh, oh, the it's, in the, it's in the back part of here, so we can either go through the fence or to the road on the, the left. the fence it is. Whoa, jeez, okay. Yep, <laughs> through the fence. Tree! Ow! Alright, I have been unwinched. Ah. I'm feeling terrible, terrible freedom, Chris. I hit a power pole. <coughs> oh no! Oh no! Chris! Ah, oh, you've just got out of reach. Oh, what am I stuck on? What? Oh, I see a barrel. All wheel drive, activate! Okay. Now. Oh. Chris! <laughs> Every time I try to winch to you, drive away. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh. Okay, oh, camera, that's not helpful. <coughs> there we go. <coughs> I have winched. Let's go. I wasn't expecting that to actually work. Alright, uh. It's. disappeared off my map. Oh, okay, it's just a pick up from here. Well, that's fine then. Uh, now, we need to go to the house. How and get house. It's all the way over here, is it? So we have to go back across the dam. Okay. <coughs> uh, my map <coughs> <has> <coughs> so many times I can't remember where we are. Okay, we need to go to there. Which means we need to go down here, this way. Whoa, whoa. Here. I'm not actually watching anything that's happening right now, so I assume you're already on the way. I am not. I'm setting waypoint. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I'm helping! Wah! I'm <laughs> being hurt! Helping! Whoa! <laughs> Wow, that was actually uh, pretty fun. Again, again. Hold on, hold on. Let <clears> me <throat> go to oh. here. Oh. Uh. Ow. Come on, Richard. <laughs> <laughs> that that really hurt my engine. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I tried hitting just the auto winch, but it connected to the pole and not you. <laughs> Ah, welcome to my world. Now you can see how that happened to me. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty fun, though. Yeah, right? It's a really good way to turn really quickly. <laughs> <laughs> like, unfortunately, too quickly. Pull me, Daddy. Only, only if you've got the reflexes of an old man. Whee! Rather nice scenery. It's a little unfortunate that the trucks don't have radios. The high gear is just so useless. 
high gear. It's slower than just auto. I don't even have a high gear. I know, but this car does. I don't know what it's there for. Like, are you supposed to go from low to high when you're trying to pick up <coughs> speed but keep all your all your power? Because like that's what low plus is there for. I don't know. I don't Ow. know what high gear does. I don't have high gear. Stop bouncing off my side. Hello, Hello Hama. So well. <clears throat> does it help when I'm grinding up against your side? I'm sure it does. You actually helped me to turn, so <laughs> that's always <laughs> nice. Well, I'm glad to be of service. <clears throat> you know the fun thing, Chris, though? We didn't need the crane this time. Yes. <laughs> Just yes. Well, who knows? Maybe we'll need it to um, unload. unload. I get the feeling that we won't need it. All right, this seems like it's a one truck at a time kind of area. As much as I want to knock you over, I want to at least <laughs> achieve more than one thing. <laughs> well, we can always go back and get another slab. Well, we've been playing for an hour, and traditionally, at least within the first hour, we have achieved one thing. And oh, we've, oh. we've done our one thing, which is unlocking the watchtower. Well, there you go. We've achieved the one thing. Yeah, but I want to get two. So if we make it there in three minutes, <laughs> we can do two things in an hour. We can demonstratively do two things in an hour if we make it there in three minutes. I don't think that's going to happen. I don't know. It's the power of winching on our side power of me slowly getting crushed by the back of your truck. Ow. Lefting. Lefting. <laughs> I'm trying to lefting. <laughs> I'm <Ow>. helping! <laughs> lefting. Lefting. <laughs> Plus, diff, lock, horn, lights, all the buttons. Yeah, got us through. Sometimes I don't actually know if any of that helps, and then other times when I'm like super stuck and doing that sort of stuff, and I just suddenly get unstuck, I'm just like, yeah, that shit really works for some reason. Physics! Physics, yay! Yeah, but Chris, that's not how physics do. Well, now I need to make a shirt that just says physics, yay. <laughs> and has a picture of an upside down truck on it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, we have the perfect uh, picture from earlier. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa! Chris. Same oh, thing. hey, same bridge as last time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, same car flipping over as last time. Well, oh, no, no, last time it was you first, then me, but in the same place. But Chris, we're down to a minute. I don't think we're going to make it, buddy. <laughs> I believe, Richard. Well, not crane mode. Oh, whoops. Hang on. Sorry, how the fuck do I... Restore crane? <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Okay. I was trying to do it myself, but then I, I thought I was over enough. But then it turns out, no, I in fact was not over enough. Ah, Yay! Cool! <coughs> Let's go! With the last 28 seconds. I just feel like me? we're not gonna get there. We're not connected anymore. I'm waiting till I can see your butt. <clears throat> I feel so alone. You shouldn't anymore. We're connected. Ah. Just like Tony Mouth Stark and that random child. Mm, I should probably at some point. What about Tony Stark? Ah, oh, Chris, we failed. 
we can't do two things in an hour. No. <laughs> Look, I won't tell if you don't. If we can get the Whoa! rest of the... <clears throat> I'm good. I'm yeah. good. <laughs> <laughs> if we can get the rest of the way without incident... <laughs> we'll just lie on our timesheet, yeah. Yeah. And then we'll get promoted, right? What? What's a little of embellishment? People do that on their resumes all the time. <laughs> I mean, how else do you get employed, right? Oh, here's the bit where I go rolling off the cliff. But does it help if I'm pushing your butt? Like Apparently if really you're pushing my butt there. from the left, so I don't roll left ways off the cliff. Whaaaaaa! Yeah! <laughs> and also if you don't go rolling off the cliff. <laughs> I think I might go flipping off the cliff, if anything. Whoa! Yep, I made it, I'm good. I feel like the game is not happy with us. Do you I get... Do you just get that sense sometimes, Chris, that a game is displeased with your actions? Nah, I think it's fine. It's I do, however, the, wonder I like this challenge. how this place functions at all when half of its roads are barely sealed and the other half are the worst dirt roads I've ever seen. Well, I have some more good news for you, Chris. Yes, Richard. Down to 10 litres of petrol and using 13 litres a minute. Excellent! Hang on, allow me to, as soon as we get over that little hump, I will, um, sacrifice some fuel to you. Oh, hey! We've now got lots of fuel. Thanks, Chris! <clears throat> and you How managed you to keep... that without stopping? You were pushing me, weren't you? I was, but I didn't think my truck was that strong. I don't know, I wasn't at all accelerating. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this Good. truck just likes to move. Likes to move it, move it. I feel it like if we were it. employed by a real truck company, we would have been sued out of our minds by now. <laughs> <laughs> We'd have to buy a new truck every day. <laughs> Like, hey boss, we delivered that one slab of concrete, but the truck's totaled again, so we're going to just need to uh, do a tax write-off. And it took us three hours longer than it should have. <laughs> and instead of going in one truck, we took two and ruined both of them. Well, that's not true. One of them's ruined, the other one is sitting in the middle of a paddock out of fuel. <laughs> but we used 200 litres of fuel for a trip that should have taken 20. <laughs> Efficiency is key. <laughs> <laughs> See? Just nothing but good sides. First person mode! Looking at my fuzzy dice. Uh, which way we're going? Left. Okay, still looking at my fuzzy dice. Oh, my pirate parrot. Oh, and the dirt that's coming inside my car. That can't be <clears throat> good, right? Just seeing bits of dirt, dirt going flying your into your car. Is that because you're sitting on my ass and there's dirt flying off of mine? I think so. But I like to think of it as this truck is just so badly damaged that it just can't hold its dirt anymore. Fair enough. Quick, Chris, we need to go right! Oh, I'm writing. You're writing the wrongs. I'm trying to preserve a little bit of fuel so I've gotten out of all-wheel drive. Is that why I'm now taking significantly more fuel and feel like I'm <laughs> dragging a 10-ton hippo? Okay, I'm back into all-wheel drive then. <laughs> but I am down to 40 litres of petrol, so half tank. Just so I'm... you are aware. I'm also down to 40 litres of petrol. Oh, good! Good! Cause... As long as we can get there. <laughs> How far away are we? Uh, well, we're... about 500 metres away. Okay. 
half a kilometer. I feel like we can get there. I mean, it's totally doable, Chris. You just got to believe. Although, having said that, it has just raised the amount of kilometers. Because I feel like we're not going in a perfectly straight line. If I go up here, it's slightly easier to drive. It's slightly less muddy. Oh, no, my petrol's red. Well, I have 30 liters if you want it. Whoa. I mean, it was your petrol to begin with. No, no, no! Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, you're still I almost good. rolled. See, it's my go anywhere truck. I would say it's impossible to roll, but we have proven that that is not true. <laughs> we have, in fact, proven that a few times now. <laughs> I'm using 12 liters a minute. Are you in low gear again? What the fuck is this? Are you in reverse? No, I no. was in normal, normal auto, but I'm now in low plus, because that's the best one for you, but it takes the most petrol from me. So I'm down to 20 litres. Let's try high gear. Is this helping? I don't know, I'm still using about 11. I think it might just be the terrain. Possibly. But, with our engines combined, we're actually not getting stuck in many of the places that we would normally get stuck. I feel like me being your support character is <laughs> the slightly more helpful way. But so, I like being the support character. That's what I'm used to. <laughs> we're 270 <laughs> meters away, Chris. And I'm down to 12 liters of petrol. How many have you got? Uh, I've got 16. Okay. So still getting there. Uh, why is this a road? Why is this where the road is? <laughs> I mean, you can tell why I went to the left last time we came here, right? <laughs> I feel like we should have hooked up a petrol trailer to my car. I feel like that would have been the smart play. I don't think we're gonna make it, Richard. But we've got to, Chris. I've we got have nine to achieve at petrol. least two things. <laughs> it's not gonna happen, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can make it happen, don't you worry. I've got seven. Well, I am petrol fully left. out of fuel. I am trying to winch myself up this hill. <laughs> okay. Going to quickly grab some petrol, Chris, and come, come to you. Trailer store. Uh, well, I'm out of petrol. I'm stuck on the side of a hill, out of petrol. I, I have to buy it. What? I thought I. Oh no. Apparently, I don't have my just trailers here. Okay, well, Chris, I'm coming to you in my truck to give you all the fuel that I have. Um, so, wait there. Actually, I should put my markers back. Uh, God, we were so close. <laughs> we were so close. So we almost made it. Whoa, we yeah, are. There we go. I hate that the grab the markers and move the map are the same button. It just, it doesn't help. Alright, hang tight buddy. 
I'm a coming. Oh, I'm hanging. Whoa! I'm going to quickly <laughs> just uh, repair because <laughs> nothing <laughs> at all happened. I certainly wasn't texting while driving. Mm, no. No, I, I would never, Chris, and how dare you accuse me of that. I am offended, sir. I said offended. But yeah, I think you're going to actually enjoy that part when you watch it back. <laughs> Even I have to admit it was rather glorious just watching me drift off into a rock. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to watch you come on the uh, map. Chris, that's private. You shouldn't be watching. Oh, you mean you just want going to watch me as I drive to you? Okay. Sorry. No, I'm going to watch you come on the map. I don't know why you're doing that onto a map, but um, well, it's a little bit weird. But how I'm else not, do I'm not you here to kink shame. Where north is? Look, no pressure, no no kink shaming here. <laughs> you do you, and apparently the map, and I will be here watching. And you do nothing, because that's your jam. <clears> Although <throat> apparently now you're into voyeurism, so. Learning new things just, about you all the time. It's just an attempt to understand. Oh, it's a learning experience, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, if it helps, Chris, I'm trying to do my actual best professional driving. Mm. So we'll see how often I get stuck. I, I wish I could zoom into the map more. Right. Like, it'd be nice if you zoomed in enough and just gave you an overhead view. Like you were a little drone flying above. Whoa. There we go. Sometimes I feel like I need more brain space to be able to use just my two hands. Considering right now, it's just three fingers and a mouse. And I still feel like my brain is not up to the task. <laughs> I use my whole hands. Yeah, but that's because you're a dirty control player. You've always just got to have control. I'm a control freak. Where meanwhile, I'm just out of control. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it's because I don't really like my keyboard that much. Chris, I have approached Richard. the bridge. Oh, please don't go rolling off. I can't save you. The bridge of infinite flipping. Oh, you made it. I'm so proud of you. Aw, thanks. Uh, it's this way. Yes. Yes. Oh, <laughs> L for lights. Because it is dark out. Alright, I've still got 60 litres of petrol. Thus proving once and for all that we were definitely doing things the most efficient way possible. Always. <laughs> Ow! What did you do? Did you hit the rocks? Uh, so there was a dip in the ground that my car just decided to nosedive into that has never done that before. So I didn't know that it was something that I was supposed to be worried about. You should worry about everything all the time. Well, I can't be that worried, Chris. I do not have anxiety. I only well, have regular old vanilla depression. Maybe you should try harder. I, I honestly prefer the awful. depression. Depression I can deal with. Anxiety can get fucked. I mean, admittedly, like, just normal old vanilla depression I've only had to see, like, a sack a few times, where anxiety just sounds just so awful. Anxiety is actually the worst.
because mental health is important. Did I do it? Did I do a message? You sure Have did. I connected with the youth of today? Uh, AHM is deeply sorry to inform me that they believe some data relating to my membership has been stolen in the recent cybercrime event. Oh, that's not good. Based on our investigation, we currently believe the following data relating to your membership has been stolen. First name and surname, gender, date of birth, email, address, phone number, client ID, Medicare number, but not expiry date. But then my question is, which one of your first names did they take? Your current or yeah. your old? Probably current. We believe the criminal has not stolen credit card and banking details, your health claims data, primary identity documents such as driver's license, HM does not collect primary data documents, health claims data for pre extra service. The federal government has issued a fact sheet about this cybercrime event and the steps you can take to safeguard your data. Boy, that sounds like it's going to be full of facts, right mm. on the sheet. And from the government? That's just so official. You can trust it. Please be assured people cannot access your Medicare details with just your Medicare card number. If you're concerned, you can replace your Medicare card using your Medicare online account on MyGov, blah, 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 blah. Extra precautions you can take. We recommend being vigilant with all online communications and transactions, namely being alert for any phishing scams. Making sure to verify any communications you receive to ensure they are legitimate. Being careful when opening or responding to texts. Regularly updating your password. Hey, Chris. Ooh, I can hear you coming. Hey, Chris. Okay, okay. Uh, refuel. You. I have no more fuel to give you. You gave me 28 liters. <laughs> That's as good as I had. <laughs> Alright. I wonder if that will get me there. Now that I've done the fast one, let's see if I can make it in the two-wheel drive truck. Because it has 239 litres of petrol. That's a lot more petrol to give you. Well, who knows, maybe I can make it 100 meters with 20 liters of fuel. Well, that's why I thought I'd just try with the little one first, because it's much faster and easier to get there. And you were most of the way anyway. So I'm hoping that you can get it. And I suppose I'll know, because it'll just suddenly say, hey, we're done. Unless you're going to be annoying and just wait right there at the end. Well, I'm trying to make it. <sighs> Fucking... Fucking? That was just the end of your thought? Yeah, I'm just... <laughs> I'm so I can see the gate. And now I'm fucking bogging down, I'm trying to winch my way out. Don't forget that one has low gear as well. I'm in low gear, I've got Are everything you on. Yes. Are you using your horn? And your lights? Yeah, it's not... doesn't seem to be doing much. Have you tried winching from your butt to something in front? This is what I'm about to do. Because then it pulls you. Ow! What the hell was that game? Oh my god, low gear is so slow. Yet all wheel drive is doing nothing. Okay. From here to here. Truck. 
How are you going, Chris? Are you still stuck? Um, I'm mostly unstuck, but I've also got six liters of fuel left. So I don't think I'm gonna make it. <laughs> okay, well, I'm very slowly getting there. I've got so little fuel that the truck's not even actually moving forwards anymore, it's just sort of shuddering on the spot. <laughs> so I'm just gonna sit here and wait for you. <laughs> Thus proving that we absolutely cannot get two things done in an hour. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel like next time we play this, we have to break that record and we have to be able to do at least two things in an hour. I believe in us. Damage thing, get out of the way. There we go. I'm just gonna let you know that it may be a slow going on my side as I'm having to mostly winch to get through things. <laughs> got one liter of fuel left. <laughs> and it's gone. How did you not make it though, Chris? You were right there. Apparently, once you're into the single digits of fuel, the truck just goes, No, I don't have enough power, and just shakes instead of going anywhere, while also chewing through the fuel. Well... Poop. <laughs> Come on, witch. Pull. Here you go. Keep it going. Keep it going. There we go. We're getting pretty good at this no-wheel drive truck. Mm. Eh. Making it. <laughs> Tell us a story while I struggle. Um... Once upon a time, there was a pigeon, and he lived in a boulder, a big hollowed out boulder. Wait, is this and a pigeon or a seagull? A pigeon. It's just not a seagull? The seagull lived on a rake. Oh, okay. Um, the pigeon didn't like to fly though, because the seagull was an asshole and would pick on him when he went flying. So the pigeon got around by rolling around inside his hollowed out boulder and crushing all those poor unfortunates that were in his way. Those poor unfortunate souls? Those poor unfortunate souls. <sighs> um, until one day the pigeon hit a slightly harder boulder in his boulder, and his boulder shattered oh, into a oh thousand no. pieces. Oh, what's and it gonna do? Left without a home or boulder with which to travel. Oh, I can see you at the uh, rolling bridge there, Richard. And yeah, using more concentration than I should have to. <laughs> it's alright, I made it. You made it. Good job, you. Because I'm not stuck in a boulder. No, well, neither is the pigeon anymore, because the, the boulder exploded. Oh, no. How's it going to get through pieces. this? So, he heard the sound coming from above him, and it was the seagull laughing at his misfortune. As they do, yeah. So the pigeon picked up a piece of his shattered boulder and hucked it ri as hard as he could right at the seagull's head. End up and up killing two seagulls with one stone? No, only one seagull. Oh. But the seagull did die. And then the police eagle was called and arrested the pigeon. The police eagle, if you will? But yes. For uh, murder. In whatever degree. Uh. Why are you stuck? What are you doing? I'm in the 
really buggy bit. Right. This doesn't look that buggy from here. Well, say that to my face. Oh, that's right, you oh, can't real. because you have no petrol. I'll yell it and it'll bounce off all these mountains and the echo will reach you. But it can't because the boulder shattered. I'm 25 meters away from the goal. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, at least you're not having to struggle with a no-wheel drive truck and absolutely no support. But anyway, well, no, he instead was I'm being just sitting here telling you a story about a, a murderous pigeon. <laughs> um, so he was taken to trial and the jury uh, of seagulls, which could an argument could be made was a poor decision, uh, found that he was guilty and sentenced to life imprisonment. No, and that's, jailbirds for life. Yes, and that's how he came to be a pet pigeon living in an aviary uh, of a sweet old woman in Manhattan. Like the lady from Home Alone 2. The Home Alone. I'll take your word for it. Which one was Home Alone 2? Uh, 2 Home, 2 Alone. How am I not moving forward? What is happening here? Because that's not a four-wheel drive. Oh, no, I see I really wish I could spectate here. There we go. <laughs> I put my handbrake on to be able to winch from my butt and then I tried to go but I didn't take the handbrake off I like your stories Chris they never go quite in the direction you think don't they where did you think that story was going to go uh, that he was going to become a uh, seagull murdering pigeon and you know be praised by all of his pigeon comrades oh no he got brought to justice uh, so much justice okay maybe there's something behind me to winch on to haha there is someone Walking behind you. That's a song from a horror movie thing, isn't it? Yes. I don't remember which one. I believe it's from um, Final Destination. That sounds about right. It's been so long since I've watched those movies. With their I thrilling plot. Movie. They're just fun. They are. I can, however, not drive near a logging truck anymore without seeing the first one happening. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, the second one, because the first one the was first the one plane. The first one was the plane. Yeah, the second one. It's it's because I saw the second one first. I don't remember what the third one was. Was the third one the roller coaster? Yes. Or was the third was, which was the fourth one the the racetrack? Uh, I never actually watched the fourth one because I had only heard bad things about it. Oh, but then no, I got Richard told that the fifth it. one got really good. Um, and I did watch that, but I don't remember what happened. Was that one the one that was just called the Final Destination? I don't remember. I just and... remember being. It had like a V in its logo. I believe you're going on the wrong road. Unless you're going to come all the way around and meet I me from the front. I am going on the wrong road. <laughs> hey, baby duck. Uh, now. I just remember there being one called like the final destination. 
and it like tied everything up really nicely and it was supposed to be the last one and then a couple of years or whatever later there was another Final Destination movie. <laughs> Well, I only remember them being up to five, so it may be that five was the final destination and it is now a six, or maybe that four was the final destination. Let me Google the final destination movies. Would those qualify for Bad Movie Day? Uh, possibly. Oh my god, Truck, how are you getting Final this Destination, stuff? Final Destination 2. Final Destination 3 was definitely the roller coaster. Oh, yeah, so the Final Destination was the fourth one. And then there was Final Destination 5. <laughs> yeah. See, I knew there was at least five. And, and I remembered that there was one called The Final Destination. <laughs> Together we put it all in place. They what were was all number three four years about apart. then? Wait, so, were they? I thought there was so, a yeah. massive gap between a few of them. No, so 2000, 2003, 2006, 2009, and then they didn't even wait the full three years because Final Destination 5 was 2011. Huh. There you go. That's all different to how I remember it. Yeah, I feel like there was way longer between Final Destination 3 and THE Final Destination. Hmm. Because I remember all the hype for the whole series had, like, died out. And then number 5 came along and everyone was suddenly back into it. Oh, there's an untitled sixth film, according <laughs> to Wikipedia. Good. Which either and means it there's... was in the works and it got canned, or it's still in the works and <laughs> we'll see it at some point soon. Well, we've missed the uh, the three year between them thing by quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, but you know nostalgia's playing a massive part at the moment of... Uh producer's mindset of what movies are going to be made and or remade. Yeah, and I really need them to stop because most of the films that they're remaking and or tacking another movie onto really div didn't need it. I found for an awful lot of them, the series had already ended rather well, and it just hmm. simply doesn't benefit from another movie. Yeah, or you've got things like The Matrix, in which the first one was really fucking good, the second two were a bit, uh, getting worse, and then they've made another one, which I still haven't seen. I haven't seen, but I was actually thinking about it the other day, and that I wanted to watch it. Just to find out if it was actually good, or if I'd it was like to watch horrible. it. So, I was afraid to watch it in case it was bad, until someone, and I can't remember who, it might have been Stefan pointed out that the second and third one were bad anyway, and I went, you're right! What am I afraid of? <laughs> <laughs> I the mean, only good one was the first one. Yeah, that is kind of a good point, right? Yeah, you so what I'd really like to do... Series. <laughs> yeah, I'd really like to watch all of them in a row from first to fourth. Oh, I feel like that's a recipe for just being completely upset. <laughs> yes, but like like a wise man once said there the no other spoon. two were shit anyway <laughs> what the problem is where are you going i'm going off the road to the I can see 45 degree <laughs> angle bit right cuz remember that bit where you were like why is this a road i thought that was the bit where you cut across instead of going around to the right nope that was just because that bit was wet. Right. So, the Final Destination series, going back to that uh, for a hot minute, had two different directors for the most part, who seemed to take turns, because James Wong did the first and third, 
and then David R. Ellis did the second and final destinations. And fifth. then whoever the fuck Stephen Quayle did is did number five. And then whoever Zach Lipovsky and Adam B. Stein are attached to this untitled sixth film. Adam B. Stein sounds like they should be a scientist in one of our terrible movie night movies. <laughs> And just oh, the entire thanks. time him doing the I'm not that Stein. The um the writers for the first and third movies were the same. Oh, I can hear you coming. But the writers for none of the others were the same at, at any point. <laughs> Good. Uh first one's airplane, second one is car crash, third one is Roller coaster. amusement park, final destination is speedway, the fifth is one what? was a bridge collapse, that's right. Oh, okay. Yeah, I definitely didn't see that. Can I just refuel you from here? No. Where? Gosh darn it! Oh, you know what I just realized? I wasn't using low gear at all that entire time. Oh, that probably would have made things easier. Significantly so, yes. Alright, can I do it from here? No. But... I can hook onto your butt. Then when our trucks kiss, Mwah! I should, ha ha, be able to refuel you. Hooray! Take all of Off my I fuel. Out. I feel like you should have enough to make it now, Chris. <laughs> I mean, I would if I could. Do you need me to have some petrol to be able to pull you? No, I I made it out of the bog. It's all good. All it's good. It's all in the hood. very very G. And now I'm gonna s watch you like you were watching me with the map. Wait. Why can't I? I have no idea what you were doing. Oh, do I have to? Unload! Hooray! Yeah. Three thousand dollars, and we're only thirty-eight minutes late. <laughs> but hooray! We did that took two such an things. incredibly long time. <laughs> so long. Oh, but we made it. We did it. We got there in the end. Because we're the greatest. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I think that's probably a perfect note to say thank you for joining us, everybody. I hope you have a wonderful time in the future. Oh, I don't have any decorations in this truck. Oh, boo. I guess we'll just have to talk on the CB radio. Oh, but I can turn my head a surprisingly far distance for being in the truck. Oh. Oh. Uh, my guy can pop his head out of the closed window. Yes, I noticed that the other day also. That's unsettling. Um, oh, hey, Chris. Hi, Richard. <laughs> um, so, yes, thank you for joining us, everybody, and I hope you have a wonderful time in the future.